August 8th of this year, I had this recent youth pastor. He preached on um, Matthew 9, 27 through 31. And if y'all aren't familiar like what this verse is, it's like it's about these two blind men, and they follow Jesus around. And then they eventually follow him into a house with furniture. And so if y'all could just like picture not being able to see, like it's, it's really hard. Like I picture them getting like bruised up and beaten and coming out like all bloody and everything because you're like running into stuff like couches and tables and whatever else you have in the house. And um, they don't give up, and they keep following him. And then eventually, like, at the end, the two men, like, talked to Jesus, and Jesus gave them back their vision. So um, my name is Elise Payne, and the three qualities I possess that are important to me is I'm hardworking, friendly, and helpful. And so, first of all, I'm hardworking because if I wasn't, I don't think I'd be in the same place I am today. For example... In junior high, I used to be lazy and given to like whatever I thought would make life easier. And so I joined sports in seventh grade and we had run like miles a day. So I had to learn not to be so lazy and everything. And then eventually I started to attend church again because I gave that up for like the longest time. And so I had to learn that I couldn't give in to like anything that I thought would make life easier for me. And so I had to work hard to stay on like the right path and do my sports and be like the best I could be at it. And so, secondly, I'm friendly, because being friendly, I see that as really important to me, because if you're rude, no one's going to want to talk to you, and then you're not going to have any friends, and like you're not going to have a lot, it's going to be super boring, so I try to be super friendly all the time, and then you might also have like people that if you're hanging out with your clique, that try to like get advice from you, and you're always pushing them off, they're not going to come back to you, and they can like keep that inside. And so that can be really unhealthy if they have no one else to tell their business to and they hold it in so long. And third, I'm helpful because some people is a fantastic thing. It doesn't have to be really big. Like, I just, I'll go on public places and hold the door open for people coming in and out. Or if someone drops something, I'll pick it up. Especially if it's like money or the wallet or something or the keys because that's, that's really important. You need that to get places, you know? So when you... <laughs> yeah, so when you think of Elisa Payne, you know, just remember that I'm hardworking and friendly and helpful. And also, like the story in the beginning, don't give up because you're going to feel like much happier if you don't and greater.